now the main course is to be set. United States versus Serbia. You couldn't ask for a better matchup. Number three in Europe versus number one in the world. As the uh, Serbians are slowly finishing, filling this uh, 7,000 arena, Cedar Arena. It's going to be an interesting uh, game in terms of atmosphere, intensity, call it what you will. The USA, the world champions, current Olympic champions, are going head to head with the home side here from Serbia. We've just seen a blowout in Nigeria, Mozambique by 34, and the 8 o'clock game is the mighty USA against the up and coming uh, Serbian women's national team. Azania Stewart joins me for the fourth game in a row, unlucky Azania. It's been a hard slog. This is going to be a great game. One versus seven in terms of world rankings. It's not bad. Yeah, definitely. You know, playing in front of your home crowd is definitely an advantage, but you are playing the Olympic champions, the world champions, uh, and no doubt they'll come out and perform. But I think, uh, you know, Serbia is, is battle-tested. You know, they did win uh, bronze in the European uh, tournament there, and they have some really good players. Dabovic, um, who's now, uh, she's she's married now, sorry, so now she's a Vasic. Um, so, uh, uh, no, sorry, Dabovic is her name, sorry. Um, yeah, so some really great team uh, effort here. Sorry, let me get myself together and keep on going. Uh, who I meant was Petrovic, sorry, she is now Vasic, she's now married. And Dabovic has some great experience. This team is well-rounded. Uh, the babies are out here to celebrate. So I'm really excited for this game. Just need the popcorn sellers now, don't we? Yeah, they must can, be around somewhere. They can come over here if they like. USA team onto the floor, first of all. A lot of household names here at Zania. This is a, uh, you talk about being the best in the world. They can probably put two or three teams together that would compete at the very highest level. Some of the very best players in the world here. Yeah, Sue Bird, one of them competing for her. That's her fifth Olympics in a row, fifth oh. gold medal as well. Did you like how I threw that alley oop to you? Yeah, well done, yeah. You yep. Talk to me about the head coaching, uh, Dan Hughes, Cheryl Reva here as assistants, but they will be taken as the head coaching role because. Dawn Staley is uh, coaching with South Carolina. Back in the state, yeah. Right. Wasn't she allowed can't get to off. leave, yeah. Here's the home team on the floor. There's number five, Vassage, I was talking about earlier. She's an automatic bucket for me. I, I really enjoy watching her playing. I'm really impressed with the way the fans have turned out. They love their basketball in Serbia for sure. Men's basketball on close to top three. This team is heading that way as well. Well, we will get uh, Nalkovic there, head coach of the Serbian team. National anthems to follow, and then we'll be right back at you, the other side. Now, please rise for the national anthems of two national teams. First, the national anthem of the United States of America.
new team huddle for Serbia. The state will await them at half court. There's the two coaches, or three coaches, should I say. The American situation will get complicated, I'm sure, with Hughes and Reeves sharing duties. Malkovic there. Marina Malkovic, long time uh, servant of Serbian basketball. And she's, uh, I've seen two training sessions of hers, uh, Zenia, in complete control. She commands full force on that court, which is uh, running sessions. Yeah, definitely. She is a very experienced coach. And you're right, she commands all the attention. You know, she blows that whistle. She knows she means business. And, and you know, true testament, Serbia is very well coached under her. So I'm excited to see how this game goes. You can never underestimate a crowd and your home team. No, no, exactly right. I mean, I've been uh, to many tournaments, and when the home crowd gets involved and you've got a team that they, they can play in front of or they can play for, then it, it makes for an interesting recipe. Yeah, you no, go ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead. I was going to just say, no doubt, that Sue Bird there will be for sure. She is 39 years old. She is then pushing for her uh, fifth Olympics. And then also, I'm so happy to see Brianna Stewart back. Uh, she was the Golden Girls. You see her in the lineup with Bird, Fowles, Abumake, and Diggin Smith there. I'm so happy to see her back on the court as she was the Golden Girl. She was MVP for the World Cup, uh, the WNBA, the, um, and the Euro League. So, really happy for her. And there we see Sue Bird. Yeah. I think the legacy that Sue Bird will leave behind when she eventually retires will be that uh, she has just about achieved everything, hasn't she, with those five Olympic, uh, four Olympic gold medals and uh, probably 60 days plus away from the uh, Olympics starting. And that's, uh, I'm sure she's got that eyes on the prize there. Serbia. Yeah, Serbia, like I said, uh, Brooks, who was Milovanovic before, uh, she's a great player. I love her. She's a big guard. And then. Uh, then there will be Vasage, who's an automatic bucket. I'm talking a walking bucket. She wears number five, and you'll see her in the starting lineup with Vasage, uh, Univanovic, Brooks there, Dabovic, and another Univanovic. Yeah, it's going to be uh, interesting to see how this Serbian team deals with the pressure that the United States can bring in, in many areas of the game defensive, offensive, you name it. Right. And we had a little chat with. Uh, Tini Ivanovic last night, was it? Or Navena Ivanovic? You'll have to help me out there. Uh, Uvena. Navena. Yep. Navena. And she was telling us they hadn't really spoken too much about the state in preparation. Now, whether that was a, a masking of Malkovic trying to play down the fact that they were playing the, the <laughs> yeah. world champions, Olympic champions, and trying to keep this team uh, not to have too many nerves. Yeah, but, but they, they do. know they've got to get uh, two more games after this. Uh, after this one to get victories right yeah you're right but she did say you know we are in front of our home court and our home crowd and this crowd has come to see the number one team so they do want to perform yes they're not worried about usa in the long run in qualifying for the ticket to tokyo but at the same time that's a good point this is your home nation this is your time to shine you've got your jersey on and and you want to perform against the best team in the world yeah there's no doubt about it and what a great uh gathering there uh, they're up to the rafters in here the Alexander Nikolic Stadium 7,000 there's a few empty seats but my word um, there's a few packed in here for sure the Americans will walk onto the floor first of all there will be a minute silence as we've had it all three games so far for David Stern the passing just after New Year and obviously the tragic loss of Kobe Bryant a little over a week ago In fact, it was last weekend, wasn't it? Yes. It's not even a week yet. So scary. Tragic loss of uh, a giant in basketball. Touched so many people. And uh, players will circle up half court.
Game on right now. This is the big one. Game four on day one. We've got two groups playing here because the uh, Foshan tournament had to be rerouted here to Belgrade. USA, the world and Olympic champions against Serbia, the up and coming uh, newcomers on the block. A wealth of experience on both teams. Who is going to come out with the, uh, the bragging rights from this game here? Favorites the USA by a country mile, I'm sure. Stewart and Bird will get the first shot of this Olympic qualifying game. And cleaned up quite neatly there by uh, Nevena Jovanovic. A wide open in here is Brooks. Brooks tries to... Oh, would have thought Brooks would have perhaps taken that shot, but he gets the penetration. Tries to dish it down, get, got a deflection, and it will stay blue ball. Uh, uh, Brooks there tried to take Stewart there, especially she's just she's just coming back, so she's probably not in great uh, game shape. Sure, Davidovic fires off first shot again, that misses. All the way back here to Jovanovic. That's never not Jovanovic. There is a teeny Jovanovic. Thirty-three on the floor. Yeah, that's uh, thirty-three is Tina. Ivanovic. And straight away getting a presence felt, make, mixing up on the boards there to make sure that uh, that was kept alive. Brittany Griner will come off the bench for this team. Things will change. That whole American bench has stood until they score their first bucket, I'm sure. Mm, I like that. Solidarity. Here's Davovic, turns the corner slightly, head fake, runs into a bit of trouble in, in the shape of an American defender. There's Ivanovic's first shot, it won't drop in. And Jovanovic is getting it mixed up. Bird comes out of the pack with the ball. Digging Smith to her left. Down left, down low. Yeah. First point for Sylvia Fowles. As USA sits down, Sylvia Fowles deep inside the paint there. That is automatic buckets. Serbia have to work early to push her out of the paint. That first big offense down the floor, run the bigs. Vasic with her first shot misses. Could be a long night if they don't start making jump shots, Serbia. We've had a couple of looks already. Awumake goes in and scores. 4 0 start. And uh, both uh, baskets in the paint is in here. A sign of things to come. Yeah, definitely. They're establishing their post play very early. And uh, Serbia here are, are shooting the, you know, nice rebound by Kavovic there. Uh, they're shooting a long range shot. Lower percentage shot than uh, USA as they're going straight to the rim. The advantage of having Davidovich at two or three inches over Berg completely now muscle around the hoop. Stewart's first shot misses, scrapes the top of the backboard. That's not out of bounds. A play on Nevenyanovich. Possibly took the wrong route there. I thought a, a Euro step inside Skyler Diggins might have worked better. Yeah, great uh, hands there by Skyler Diggins Smith. She's a now a married lady. She's at Smith on the end. Yes, I did know. I just forgot. That's all. No worries. I'm here to help. Yes, thank you. Here's Tini Jovanovic to ne Nevena Jovanovic. Tini, that's a good looking move, too. Tie game 4 4. Great. And also talking about Stuart coming back. This is a. Uh, uh, Scarlett Digger-Smith after having a baby, so great to see her back out on the court. And that's a foul on Brooks, maybe, Brooks. as she puts her hands well, I'm up. Gonna, I'm going to re-identify somebody. Somebody we thought was playing with Jovanovic is Krasinik in the game at 33. Oh. That's caught us both by surprise, that has. Well, she came up on the starting five as uh, Jovanovic, I read that. I'm not sure. Second free throw is long. Score stays at 4 4. Both free throws missed there for Brianna Stewart. Very young, uh, Brianna like. Davidovich wide open on that back screen. They'll run a lot of back screens, down screens, and the bigs. Layup is good for Serbia. <laughs> Great move there by Tina Iranovic to just take on Sylvia Fowles. Lovely, strong move to the basket. Fowles on the far side there.
Davovic penetrates in. No foul. He's got a piece of that. And a foot standing out of bounds. Silvia Fowles is so tough. I've, I've played against her in the pre warm up game uh, before the Olympics. Here we see Dabovic drive against her. Look at that. Great timing with her hands. Big, strong body. Uh, she's tough to score against. Brooks up top. Vasic with the ball screen. Brooks throws it up. Uh, good rebound from uh, Sonia Vasic. Long career in Russia did Vasic. Damovic throws up up. It was a shot clock running down prayer, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Super, the whistles from this Serbian crowd. It's going to be an interesting game if the crowd becomes a factor. Stewart, her second three is short. Never get a man of inch after the races. Layout, always missed. Vasic cleans up. Vasic three. And never knit Jovanovic flying in for a offensive rebound. Will go against, uh... She is actually married. I've just found out she's not Jovanovic anymore. It is Krasnik, is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. got that sorted out. That was worrying me. Yeah, well, it came up as the starting five as Jovanovic, but as you see on the back of her jersey there. And the stats I wrote down as Jovanovic, too. Uh, okay, no worries. Teamwork, we're here. Bird under the, interesting enough that uh, Davidovich went under the pick and roll. That's a tough, tough move. And how difficult is that move? Just to keep her pivot foot alive. Uh, you know, Sylvia Fowles is MVP of the WNBA uh, a couple of years yeah, back. Yeah. So she's definitely well established, a true vet, and a great at the post position. Good ball screen for Brianna Stewart. Bird wide open. She missed the first three. That one's going to go long, too. Cleaned up by uh, Vasic. This is a good start from the Serbian team. Yeah, solid start for Going them. Toe for toe with the United States. Nevena Jovanovic is number eight here. Pressing it with the ball screen the other side for Petrovic. Uh, sorry for Vasic. This time uh, Pressnik has another easy one. What a rebound. Oh, you missed the shot, fair enough. I don't think Malkovic would be happy with that finish, but to get the rebound back again, that is some strength in there. Right, but you don't get any good um, closer look than that. They're definitely playing tough, but, you know, Serbia is known for a gritty team. They're not going to be afraid. Some people, you know, get shocked in the lights of the whole big USA, but Serbia's here oh, to no. play. No, no, no fears. I think the, the turning point for me was when the, the subs come off the bench for the United States. Griner. Right. Three layups missed for Serbia, one for Vasic, two for Krasnik, and Nevena Jovanovic has that one right down the throat. Davovic, oh, and a no look pass, and unfortunately Krasnik didn't expect it. Up for Stewart, Stewart latest with up two points. 8-6 lead for the USA. Yeah, I'm really happy to see here as we see Super right into the pocket of Stewart. Lovely layup there. Stewart's looking pretty good. She's moving well. She commend her for her, uh, you know, long process of rehab back from the Achilles. She looks fantastic. Dalovic is just having the game of her life. I mean, she knows she got the 39-year-old bird guard and that she's just going to make sure she chases her around. Unfortunately, the subs coming in now, one of them be for Bird, which means now Dalovic gets a new mark. Yeah, here comes Chelsea Gray. And Ariel Atkins. So one of them will pick up Dalovic. Gray is going to go with that. Uh, Atkins won a WNBA championship with um, the Mystics this year, I'm wow. pretty sure. I'm going to come back to that in a minute, the WNBA championships and uh, World Olympic gold medals. It's quite an interesting little fact. Okay, don't Brooks, ask me any questions. 18-footer for Yelena Brooks misses. So they're missing a few shots. They missed layups, three of them. And if you count that missed pass from Danovic, that would be four. Under the screen for Scarlett Diggins Smith, too. Atkins gets a pick and roll and loses it. My word, the defense. Atkins now is having to deal with the pressure here. 
Millage. Yeah, definitely her length, uh, definitely, you know, changes your shot in many ways. And also, uh, Jewel Lloyd uh, subs in at number four for uh, Subo. She's just over in the corner, just said a, a little prayer to herself. She's obviously a Lloyd wide open, great cut too. Atkins fires up a three, lefty, good. Five point lead for the USA. Timeout for Marina Malkovich, she's seen enough. Great start for Serbia, but they trail by five and they missed. Four layups. And you know what's so good? Here we see the skip in by into Lloyd, back out to Atkins, and she hits that three. Great ball movement. You know what the strength is truly of USA? It's the The wave keeps on coming, keeps on from from Griner to you know who else? They, you name it, um, and that's why I think USA is so tough because as soon as Sylvia Fowl uh, subs out, you have to deal with Brittany Griner. So it's a constant effort and pressure by USA. So I don't know if Serbia can really withhold that strength of USA. Yeah, there aren't many teams in the world that can say that, right? Australia, Spain would be two and three in the world in rankings. Here's Vasic up top. And uh, great defense there from uh, Ariel Atkins. Yeah. Great, oh, well read by Nemina Jovanovic, and she just looks up to the sky to say that was one that should have been uh, picked off. Erin passed there from Chelsea Gray. I'm not sure where. Right. You could see where it was going, but right. it wasn't the right choice. Yeah, Chelsea Gray is definitely a wizard with the ball. You'll see it throughout the game. She'll just no look off, nice pass. She's a, a real, really good uh, point guard for America. Reiner on the post up. Millie, they're going to double this one. Reiner goes in, goes sky. Well, that's not a game, is it? It's more a better player off two feet rather than that one. Uh, one footed uh, Kareem Abdul Jabbar style shot. Yeah, I've, I've seen that from Brittany, though. Brooks, great. Great draw in the foul there off Gray. And that is a true sign. There's nobody uh, going to lie down here. 11-6 the lead for the USA. Set to come in the game is uh, Bojevic, Miljana Bojevic. Just trying Sasha Chado, number six. It's Milich. It's Brooks has that just deflected by uh, Wu McKay. Yeah. Just such long arms. She's really good on defense. Aisha Wilson comes into the game, number nine for the USA. You see what I'm talking about with the subs there. We have a Bumake with great length and, uh, and strength. And then you sub in Asia Wilson. Like, oh, they're not spoilt for talent. Sure, it's right. It's like for like. They don't drop off. Brooks. Brooks settles for a three. They just need a couple of those to drop down. Vasic is so active on that. I've been impressed with the, the activity offensive boards. It's a really uh, positive play. Is uh, Wilson's first shot a little bump? Referee's quite happy to let that one go. Let him play a bit. 
Bojevic. Which playing a little bit of uh, cat and mouse there. And Ariel Atkins, Vasic. Vasic has got so much experience. Chelsea oh, Gray oh. taking the school on that one. Yeah, Vasic has definitely been in some big time moments. She has hit game winners for this Serbian team. And an offensive foul. Brian, Brian knows full well. That was a, a little push, a little nudge at the end. She's got big shoulders, Brittany Grant just leans in at the last minute. Takes out uh, Bojevic. Chado to inbound to 15 for so There's Malkovic there. She can't be too displeased with the start. And that's what we're very happy with that. You know, what's uh, Vasic's complaint to the referee? She complains that wallet might be missing. The defense was all over her. She said she's all over me. So I can read this. Dragana Stankovic is in the game, number 14. If you're going to compete with the States, you've got to have some height. Serbia's definitely got that. Offensive foul down the other end. Same call. Yeah, same fair. Stankovic there. Just kind of uh, let her arms come Didn't see as much in yeah. there. Did you see that? No, I did, I did. As she screamed, she just kind of uh, extended her arms. Fair call. Can't call it one way and not the other. It's Chelsea Gray, 18. Andrew Wilson comes up top, looking down low for Griner. Look it all over. Griner is fouled and almost dropped in. They had three players surrounding her right there. Any lob pass down low to her is going to get caught. She's got great hands. She has wonderful hands. And honestly, that's been her whole career. That as soon as she catches, people are smothering, people coming to double, trap, triple. Uh, so she's used to that, so she just needs to take her time and, and really get the hand one. Do you want to hear a fun fact? Go for it. Uh, when I was playing Brittany Griner with Florida versus Baylor in the NCAA second round, yep. Brittany Griner dumped on us. <laughs> Fuck you? Yeah, I was in the way. Was in the way? Yeah. Is there a photograph to prove this? Sure is. Google it, baby. <laughs> I love it. We might see a dunk tonight, you never know. She has got a huge wingspan. Stankovic fires one up into the midnight sky, comes down with nothing. USA, this way you don't want to play USA on the break. Atkins wide open, Atkins drops a, a twine three-pointer. Straight music. Yeah, that is automatic for Atkins. Two for two there, if you see at the bottom, six points. He's Butelija top. Far side, three responses good from Chano. I like the way Bujevic picked up Chelsea Gray straight away, full court, making sure there's nothing easy on the floor out there for these American guards. Here's Atkins. Atkins finds Jewel Lloyd, right a turn. Oh, what a move. What a move. Poetry in motion. Azania, that must take you back a few years to your day. Look yeah. at this pivot on the right foot, goes up. Draws contact. Fist pumps, there you go. That's a great basket by Brittany Griner. And that's truly, she has that all night. Nobody can stop that. Do you know what I mean? She has great footwork, she has great hands, lovely touch. Here, as we see, Atkins hit the three from Lloyd. You know, and, and good for the USA to establish Brittany Griner early down low when she likes to receive the ball. I heard a great phrase in Canada all day breakfast, feasting all day on it. <laughs> That low post play. Dragan Stankovic goes up. Butelija skips it to Chano. Chano's made one. The crowd love this. There's two. Back to a four-point game. Sasha Chano. Well done, Chano. If they're going to stay in this game, they have to hit shots. Last 10 seconds here. Chelsea Gray just takes her time. Well, Gray finds her way. Oh, wow, well, they, they held for the last shot. Gray held on to it. And once Gray came into the lane, Stankovic said, this is my house. Get out of here. Good defense by her. Last two seconds here. Well, oh, Brian's for the lob. Nice play. Beautiful bucket. How good is that? 
Hats off to the coaches for drawing that one up. Unreal. Yeah, and there's nothing you can do around that because, you know, she has worked on her 15 footer right there, as we see USA 20, Serbia 14. Honestly, I feel like Serbia's done a really good job staying within it. They've started to hit shots, uh, and USA have definitely, you know, found their way as we see the stats. Uh, nothing really too crazy other than the USA have got to the free throw line five times. Serbia have, haven't got to the free throw line, so then maybe they look to be a bit more aggressive. from the first 10 minutes of action. That was the first bucket for Sylvia Fowles, running first big down the floor, just got herself in that circle, planted herself there. And that was the next one, I think, the woman came. Again, Fowles did, created the space in there. Yeah, I think uh, Serbia have done a great job to stay with USA, but through the course of the game, USA will just grind you down. I've, I've discussed it already for their subs, like for like. And there's a t-shirt, maybe. There's a t-shirt toss going on wide. You can't see it if you go run the replay. There we go. The t-shirt went, went 10 feet, landed in the media box. Nice uh, layup there from Stuart. Um, yeah, and I think throughout the game, they'll just slowly grind out. They'll slowly, you know, wear you away because they do sub like for like. So, and Serbia, does, I mean, they do have a, a deep bench, but nothing like uh, America does. So, it'll be very interesting to see how this second quarter goes. Yeah, you make some good observations there because I'm not sure any team in the world can put a, a bench team to compete with the bench of America. I mean, I don't think they have a strongest five, do they? They can put any five on the floor and say, oh, that's pretty much our strongest five. Right. They're all at equal level. Take Griner out of it, maybe, because Griner is potentially the best player in the world, along with maybe Stewart. Here we go. AJ Wilson, second period to start. Griner will post up, and you can guarantee she'll go to work. They'll even go the other way. Atkins, Gray, he's doing a good job of keeping her out the lane. Griner gives it up. Yeah, good defense by Village there on Brittany. Gray fires one up and two, and how hard can Serbia work defensively Ooh. only to see the ball in the bottom of the net? That's uh, going to be deflating, yeah. Yeah, Milic is doing a great job on Brittany, just keeping her hands out, using her body there. That's a good pass, too. I'm sure you want to be going up against the Griner in a one on one, too often low post. You don't have to move far to block shots. State's on the run here. Gray into the lane. Aja Wilson will get her first jumper of the game. Good box out for Kutalija. I mean, that's one thing you've got to do. Make sure it's one and done, right? You Correct. can't give up offensive rebounds. You can't give up offensive rebounds. You have to hit your shots. Ooh, Stankovic was blocked there by Aja Wilson. The slow release from Stankovic gave Wilson the opportunity to get in there and involved. Maybe the follow-through is what the referee saw. And See, pretty uh, yeah. Well, pretty Grind is just explaining <laughs> what is either she's doing the, uh, the, hooking. the arm hook, the arm lock, or it's happening to her. Sue Bird back in the game. They've, they've, she's lost nine games wearing an American shirt in her career. Who's Sue Bird? 134 victories, yeah. Wow. We're talking a legend. That's a great stat. A legend in her own lunchtime. It's uh, incredible, really. USA lost three games in Olympic history. Do you know who they were against? I told you this morning. Um, Maybe I didn't. Japan. One, yeah. Yes. One, one. That must have been a strange loss. That was 76, too. Griner low post. It's a great look, far side. But Jewel Lloyd with a shot. Yes, it is. Missed it. And the Estates bring up the boards. Can't give them second opportunities. Only Brittany Griner could pull that one out of the hat. That was way up in the air. USA moving the ball well. Another deflection from Serbia. Great defense from the Serbian team. Shot clock done. Wow, hands off. That's back to back defensive plays there. Fantastic movement from USA, but well done, Serbia. As uh, uh, Atkins retires her shoes. Um, oh, she lost her shoe. Look at that. Yeah. Oh. Uh, great defensive possession there for Serbia just to hold on. Uh, even though uh, Atkins got them an extra possession on the rebounding end. 
as she uh, flew out of her shoe doing so. Shot on the, the fence there. Here's Bojevic at point guard. She's played really well, actually, this uh, backup guard for so this is the offense the states were reviewing yesterday and they've done the different option boy of it penetrates that wasn't in the uh, scout report chada third three oh just missed but the states can get off to the break here bird corner jewel wilson goes in and scores mvp of the under 19 world championships Adrian wilson in 2015 in russia was there to witness that she was going up against Fanny Ava in Russia. Not a bad player herself. Stankovic back out to Bojevic. Milic in the lane. Griner goes after it and obviously bothered it. Stankovic the rebound. This will be wide open. That shadow. Cooled off. Missed. Yeah, she's cooled off a little bit. USA here is playing some really nice basketball, just swinging the ball. Tough wow. catch there from Atkins, but... It just shows you how well the defense is playing low post here on Griner. Griner settles for a jump shot. That's probably not, not better, a good option for Serbia. Yeah, if you can push Griner out that far and, and you know, make her settle for that 50-footer, yeah, sure. great, you'll take it every day. That's a tough, tough move. From 13 minutes, she came back on a reverse pivot against Griner. Aja Wilson goes deep into the lane and Dragana Stankovic picks up a foul. Wholesale sub for Serbia and Brianna Stewart in for the States. Three coming in, Krasinic, Nevena, Jovanovic. Looks like uh, the other one coming, can you see? Uh, Brooks, Brooks is in as well. It's the fourth sub in Damovic, so four subs in one play, that's not bad. Yeah, this is back to the starters other than um, Boyic. Yeah, Boyic did not start, that means who started in the place? Aja Wilson, I'm not sure she needed to bring it down, but she ended up with two points anyway. Lead is nine. It's uh, getting to a proportion now where Serbia have to be mindful that they need points down the end. That's a great turnover from Bird. Stewart is fouled by Bojevic. That is a good foul. Second team foul for Serbia. So therefore, they won't be, uh, won't be penalized with free throws. Now Bird's calling, looks like a horn set. Michelle Reed there, along with Dan Hughes, they're co-coaching. I'm sure it's working fine, but I'm not sure many countries can get away with co-coaching. <laughs> both assistant coaches normally for this team, but both head coaches in their own right in WNBA. Skip pass here to Stewart. Stewart goes up. Had a great night yet, Brianna Stewart. This might settle her down a bit, she can score from this one. Goes up again, misses, 0 for 4, two of them threes. Davovic, that's a good looking pass, or was, until Bird spotted it. Yeah, uh, Brianna Stewart isn't really, you know, she's not finishing, but that's inevitable, especially when you've been out so long as she uh, she has been, and these are her first true games. So that will take time, but I'm, I'm glad to see she's confident enough to drive to the basket, to get in there, sacrifice her body. Uh, it will slowly come. Damovic hit the deck there. I think she ran into her own player. Krasinic maybe just knocked her over. Bojevic, Krasinic looking to get out. Never a Yelvanovic here, eight. Bojevic penetrates on Bird. Bird, oh, it's a great pass. And look, fortunately, Krasinic didn't expect it. Off to the races is Ariel Atkins. Beautiful play from Wilson. It wasn't a great pass in the end from Fowler, but how much did she make of that? Yeah, an amazing work from uh, Asia there. Just working Brooks all the way down and then just using her height. And she outjumped Brooks there. She's not boxing her out, so she had a second opportunity.
11 point lead, 28 17. So it's gone uh, fairly stale as far as the Serbian team's concerned in terms of points production. They did miss those four layups in like, the first five minutes of the game. That would have given them a little bit good more the lead, I think, really, yeah. to be honest with you. And that's what's so important those little baby easy buckets are so important in these type of games. Your free throws and those easy buckets. So Damovic to Bojevic as they start again to try and uh, build some uh, opportunities to put the ball in the bucket. Damovic comes over that uh, little double screen. Krasnic the ball screen. Damovic loves this shot. Krasnic battles for the rebound. Diana Stewart, one and done for the United States. That's the way they like to play it too. One opportunity to score, that's all you get. Wilson drive, will pick the puck from Bojevic. They've got numbers here, Serbia. Good play from Bojevic to take the sideline rather than run down the middle of the floor. And how much patience is that? No, no opportunity to score. So just bring it out and run an offense. So what shot you come up with next, isn't it? Brooks wide, wide open. And she doesn't need a second look. That's all. And Brooks has that deep range. Uh, I've seen her shoot that many a time, so that's not new for her. Foul there from Krasin. It's 33 as Aja Wilson got the uh, wet ball screen to the baseline. Uh, Azania, so difficult to stop. It is really yeah, difficult to yeah, stop. Yeah. You definitely have to have a game mind to it. Do you, they usually call it like an ice kind of do you push it to the baseline, do you trap it? Uh, and especially when you've got somebody uh, who can handle the ball, like Asia, Asia Wilson, who can really drive, it is very difficult well, to so The next pass defense becomes so critical. Right. And she has such great height. Uh, shame she misses there to reward herself. But definitely, I think they go to that a lot because it's so difficult to defend. So Asia Wilson is one of the players in this team, uh, Azania, who's an NCAA champion of South Carolina. She sure is. Sue Bird, another one with UConn. Yep, uh, Stuart with the uh, UConn. Well, I was coming back to Stuart, because Stuart won ev all four years in university. Yeah. But how incredible is that to win? I, um, I read something really cool the other day. Uh, everything that Stuart touched turns to gold. Oh, lovely. I like that. Yeah. Probably uh, prophetic words. MVP of the World Championship last year. Sorry, 2018. Yeah. MVP in the WNBA. Yep. That was a long three. Bojevic chases it out of bounds. Can only give it to Bird. Bird might ignite the fast break here for the States. He's looking up. He's looking up. Down low to Fowles. There's a skip pass here somewhere. And the foul will go against Brooks. Brooks walks away, hand up, with a smile on her face. So surely you're not going to call something as small as that. <laughs> the game as Bojevic steps out. That'll put Dabovic at the point guard. No, I'm sorry, Jovanovic. Nevena Nevena Jovanovic will go point. And of course, Brittany Griner won with Baylor. She sure 2017. did. 2017. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry, 2000 and... Uh, ooh, yeah, there's no shortages. Nice broke still, sadly. Couldn't get the ball. There's no shortages of championships and winning on this team yeah, between yeah. NCAA uh, championships, WNBA championships, Euro League championships. Uh, they definitely know how to win. So 11 players in the history have an NCAA, a WNBA, a World Championship Olympic gold medal. Wow. 11 players and three are on this team. I'm going to say Super. One. Sylvia Faust? Nope. Ooh. Okay. Stavlovich comes down the other end here. Shorich is 24, but you've got one right. No Stewart one. one. Diana Stewart is one. Jovanovic in. Serbia trying to find points here. Davovic should get a little easy look here. Rushed it a little. Subert off to the races, and there's a, a sense around this arena. America on full swing here. Digging Smith nails the three, and he was. Back to Brooks. Brooks one on one with fouls. They're panicking a bit right now, so we need to slow things down. Just take the pace out of this game. Just make sure America don't get into a running game. That's a foul against Stewart. Stewart just bumped Krasinich going to the hoop. So you got one more left. I'm going to go with 
No, because I don't think she's won an NCAA. So you've got to go with the NCAA Stop champions. It. They're the ones. It's Brittany Griner. She... Oh, it's Brittany Griner. Yeah. That Baylor win. Baylor win. Tough move from Brooks. Yeah. And the foul is against the Rubicade at the 16. She turns around with the uh, utmost surprise. She might say, can we look at the referee, the replay, please, coach, the referee? Oh, there's, I no, there's no VAR on this. I should, have, uh, I should have known the Brittany Griner because she won the championship. I was in the second round when she dunked on me. How oh. did I not get that? Oh, it was the tournament you got dunked on. Yeah. Oh, well. That was the last game you called them, was it? Yeah. Brooks finishes a three-point play, closes the gap to 11. So the next question is, who's the next player potentially could break into that 11-person Elite, elite band of players who won all four. Uh, one of the Samuelson sisters, Katie. Could do. Three again from Diggin Smith. Wow, well, she's found a touch, same spot, same result. And a 14 point lead now. Yeah, she's heating up. Skylar Diggin Smith, two for two from the three point line. Shorich down to Jovanovic. Takes the ball screen. Davovic will have to launch a huge three. Two arms up in the air to tell the referees exactly what the call is. Three balls in town. Look at that. That's definitely, they have range between Brooks and uh, Davovich there. Long range threes. And foul from Davovich as well. That is team foul number four. And that's going to five. So Diggin Smith will get two shots here. So, NCAA champion. And then WNBA world champion and Olympic champion. That's quite a resume. Adrian Wilson. Wow. Okay. 2017 NCAA. She has got a world championship medal. This summer, potentially, she'll get an Olympic medal. All she needs now is the WNBA to cap off and get into that, make that 11 or 12 person pool. Very elite band of players. Great pass and the thrust. Is, that is beautiful basketball. Low post, cut, and it's old school. Yeah, really great movement from uh, Serbia there. Got it back to 11. Can they get it to single digits before the break? Stewart comes flying in. Uh, yeah. Straight away, Wimbledon holds their hand up to not a good part. I don't think Stewart is ready for it. Yeah, she just needs to wait that split second for Stewart just to set her, her post move and set her feet. Yeah, you can see what the, uh, the idea was for sure. Same play coming up here for Tensu Davovic in the low post. No, Davovic will pop out. Jovanovic, no. It's a good looking shot that they're getting the looks. They sure are getting the looks, aren't they? Keeping the turn. You know what? They're actually slowing the USA down to 39 and a half is not where the United States usually would expect to be against the international opposition. We've got another foul against Sylvia Brooks. Fouls. I think she used the elbow. She no, posted it's not against up. Brooks. It's fouls, yeah. But hit Brooks in the face. And I also think Serbia is doing a great job in transition defense, trying to slow them down a bit. Let's see what happens here. Look, see, she just oh, hits yeah. her in, in, in a the mouth. One. It's uh, post and foul, and elbows out. Never a non-contact game. Yeah, she'll feel that in the morning. And there's Brooks coming up top. Good catch. Davovic low. They're going to go for this. They're going to go for this post up. There's a foul. There. I think Diggin Smith. A great play from Serbia to isolate Diggin Smith in that low post. There's a woman, Kate. Stewart. So about six foot four. Diggin Smith. Oh my word. Woo! Ice run through those veins as she drills her third three. And without those three threes, this would be an interesting game. 12 points now. Foul there from Diggin Smith down the other end. Picks up Davovic straight away. All these players have played against each other for uh, two or three years now in the European circuit. Yeah, great sportsmanship there Absolutely. from uh, Diggin Smith. But Davovic is back at the line, exactly what you want, kind of get these easier points from the free throw line and go into halftime. 
Yeah. Cutting into that lead. And she hits the first. Eight points now for Anna Davovic. I wonder if, how many uh, this crowd, obviously last summer the Europe basket came here, third place after that tough loss. I think lost to Spain in the semi-finals, didn't they? It wasn't as close. Yeah. And they completely blew out Great Britain in the third and fourth game. Almost a turnover there. Great pressure from Serbia. Well, the United States having to work for their money. Digging Smith again. Heat check. And a turnover. They got numbers again. Down Mitchell up for possession here. 18 seconds before half time. Not going to rush this one. And that's uh, that's the experience of some of these players. Yeah, Davidovich just pulls them back, pulls to the screen. Good defense from the States. Trasinic got it. That is tough play. That's a good, yeah, 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 that's a great, uh, you know, back to back baskets we see. They make a cut into that lead. 34 points to 42 to USA. Good job, Serbia, to, you know, withstand the wave of the strength of USA. And they just got some really good buckets and just kind of kept working hard down on the defensive end. Here we see the stats, 61% uh, for uh, USA at the two. And then really, um, 5 to 12 is a pretty good stat, not bad, but they're rebounding pretty even, 21 for Serbia, which is surprising, 19 for uh, USA. You know, like I said before, USA will grind down of the of the record of the game. Just kind of thing, it's hitting three for three. She is unstoppable. And Damovic there uh, for the top scorers. But they will grind you out through the, the process of the game. But I think Serbia is doing a wonderful job. Just kind of sticking with it. Understand, as we see some of the highlights, understand that this is going to be a long 40-minute game. Take your time. Make sure you execute. And, you know, right at the beginning of the game, we talked about them missing a few layups. If you add those, you know, six points, seven points, you're right in it. Yeah, well said. I couldn't say it any better than that. One thing I will say, Scarlett Diggins is married now. She's Diggins Smith. Yeah. Not putting it back on her. <laughs> she's married and she's just coming back from, uh, she just had a baby as well. Yeah, so she took the year out, if I'm, I'm pretty sure, yeah. uh, from the WNBA. Oh, so really well today, wonderful. Sure. She's Left doing it. Hands. She's doing it for the mums out there. I'm really loving that. <laughs> the mums club. The mums club. Some replays here of the first half. Um, uh, I've been really impressed with the way Serbia have stuck to their guns. Yeah. You know, there was a point where it could have been uh, blowout time before half time. I did notice in the stats, and we'll back it up when we come back after the break. The Serbians have actually taken more shots, 36 to 30 is the shot count. And have more rebounds. Yeah, and they had eight offensive rebounds. Eight offensive rebounds. So uh, those numbers are very, very healthy. And considering they weren't worried, they didn't really scout USA, they just wanted to play their style and play in front of their crowd. They're doing very well, they're sticking to the true uh, Serbian, you know, gritty uh, style. So good for them, and uh, I'm ready for the second half of, of great basketball. Yep, exactly so, Zania. Join us in about uh, 11, 12 minutes. We'll see a few more of these reruns coming through. Wonderful basketball to come, 20 minutes left. As Brooks drains the three, we'll take a break. We'll see the other side of halftime. Oi, 
Sjajne pojma, također Moran Aleksandra Nikolić pokažete stand face painting i napravite ove narječke pojme. Kako se zoveš? Ara. Ara, gdje igramo? Košarke? U Pijedini. Svaka čast, pozdrav za Republiku Srpsku također. Isto, budućnost u Pijedini. Dobro, vi ste budućnost i... Stand. Hoćemo trojke, može. Možda odlazite za tri. Možda, a? Ajmo, probaj. Izvoli, vidi tamo kod nog asistenta, idemo sa tri pozicije. Ajmo aplauzu, Alanu, ajmo aplauzu za Krka Budućnu Spjedina. Prečera se ovdje mnogi navijači Srbije iz svih gradova u Srbiji. Aplauzu za sve trenere koji su doveli devojke koje treniraju u košaku. Bravo, Laro, polako, taj treći šut. Ajmo, ajmo, Lara, i za Lara. Ok, Daniela, izvoli. Aplauz za Danielu. Naravno, sva tri dana družit ćemo se sa našim ujačima. Daniela, opa. Tako se to radi u Bjerini. Još jedno... Sama. Ajmo, Sandra. Sandra, verovatno gleda u pozici Becker i Blair. Opa! Ovako, Sandra. Malo treninga nije na ovdje da se istrči u lopke do lopte. Ide! Piš! I još jedan aplauz od Sandru. Evo ga! Dakle, jedan od. Jedan, jedan, ajmo bacanja. Ajmo bacanja, penali, penali. Da dobijemo pobjednicu. Sandra, izvolite. Poslije nema preko šelkašnice Srbije i Amerike. Stativa. Izvolite. Daniela. Idemo još, imamo vremena, još malo. I mislim da će sad ući. Ima ko će dobiti prvu nagradu. Bravo! Izvolite ovdje. Vlasta uvijek sa vama. Vlasta uvijek uz naše košarkašice. Još jednom aplauz za sve naše tri devojke i za sve vas koji ste došli po ranu. Aleksandar Nikolić da bodite Srbiju. Sutra sloboda dan, družimo se opet ovdje na večerima Plotne Nigerije i Mozambika u subotu i nedelje.
back everyone half time here in uh, belgrade you serbia to make sure you come for me with the win well i think rebounding has been Coach a real key i think here. serbia's done a great job of getting on the glass got eight offensive rebounds i think whoever controls the rebounding second half is going to have the ability maybe to separate we've seen skylar diggins she's been uh, taking her shots in the first half more of the same in the second excuse me from skylar diggins more of the same in the second half yeah you know th th those were great ball movements you know she's set Got a good base on those shots. We'd love to see more of that and that kind of ball movement. All right, thanks, Harry. Thank you. Coach, a very competitive first half of basketball there. Down by eight at a half. What are you looking to see from your team to come back and take the win? We allow Team USA too many fast breaks, too many um, points from the paint. And this is my first idea. This is the first thing that we have to stop. They had 18 points from the paint and 10 points from fast break. This against USA is not allowed. Thanks very much, guys. Best of luck. Uh, two contrasting responses there to the uh, current situation. Serbia's Marina Malkovic, who uh, were impressed with the uh, attire there, Mazania. Yeah, she had a little Tweety Bird uh, pin on her jacket. And Beyond Rose on her uh, sweatshirt. <laughs> yeah, I love that. I uh, had the shop yesterday when she came into practice in the gilet, and I uh, uh, her sweatshirt yesterday she just said in Paris. Yeah, beautiful neon letters right across the top of her sweatshirt. I think I remember seeing that before, but uh, as I say, when she walks on the floor, she uh, commands respect wherever she goes. And Dan Hughes, the trouble understanding the English uh, accent. Uh. Yes. <laughs> well, he was very complimentary of Diggins Smith's ability to shoot the ball, set the legs right. Right. Three threes from uh, this Diggins Smith. I think she's from South Bend, Indiana, you know, a Notre Dame player. Yeah, she played in Notre Dame. Um, and, and, you know, I think if you're watching this and you're watching USA, who are one of the best, uh, Skylar Diggins-Smith, the set of, uh, of her shot, you know, making sure her feet are in perfect position, the follow-through. Her shot is very textbook, and I know she works a lot and very hard uh, on that shot throughout the summer. So good for her for hitting those threes. Well, you know what? If you don't work on your game with this USA team, I guarantee there's oh, four or five out. players behind you are working on your game. Once you're 
in this team, you don't want to lose that jersey. That's for sure. Somebody's breathing down your neck to get your playing time. Competition makes everything. Third, pe uh, third period set to start here. Serbia have uh, shown they've got the talent to answer the questions the USA are posing. Smiles for Davovic and Bird there. They just spoke about... Uh, what they're having for tea? <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. What are we having for dinner tonight? Anyway. Sure. I must admit, Serbia has put on a great tournament. Their lovely host country here looks after us well. As usual. No yeah. complaints here. Brooks, Brooks. Brooks up. What a move that would have gone in. That was not bad. She'll have to get back on defense now. Five on four for the States. Foul because she's down to Awuma K. Back to Stewart. Bird, great ball move. Digging Smith. Foul gets the pass over the top. She misses a rare one there. Goes up again. Misses again. And wonderful play from the Serbian defense to corral that one in. Yeah, Vasic wide open here, puts the ball on the floor, penetrates, little teardrop misses. Mm. She'd like to get that one back again, I'm sure. For sure. Serbia's doing a wonderful job, though, just corralling around uh, Sylvia Fowles, making it difficult. She missed two shots right under the basket there. Good job, Serbia. And let's see if they can get another defensive stop here. Oh, well, okay, she'll get the easy one here. Left hand finish. She probably the right hand would have been the easy one, but she went to difficulty and came up good. I do love her game also. Milic to Brooks. Basic wide open here. She can shoot the ball, just uh, taking her time. Davovic, I think Bird tried to ice that ball screen there. Milic steps in. I'm oh, sorry, Brooks. Coming up with tough shots right now, Serbia. This is where they were in a period during the second uh, quarter. Yeah. Need to find some easy points. Stewart, Bird. Bird, little 15 footer. Long misses. Nobody really wants to take this game by the scruff of the neck right now. Davovic spins on the ball screen. Well, Milic will take the open. J and scores the first points and actually second points of the quarter of the third period. Here's Milic's shot right here on the baseline. You know, I haven't seen much of Milic, but I'm really enjoying her play, how physical she was here with Sylvia Fowles before with uh, Brittany Griner and there with a nice 15 footer. As Stewart shoots that and misses. Way off on that one. She missed two in the first half. Chado, I'm not sure Chado needed to give that one up. Gets it back again. I think the first shot was hers to take. Yes, yeah, the defense is close to the corner. Yep. Didn't quite read it enough. Stewart. It's a fight that didn't seem to be clicking too much. Digging. Smith is fouled on the three. And oh my word. And it's so Shadow has followed through. I'm not sure what she's caught in terms of uh, digging Smith. We're going to find out now. Oh, arm, shoulder, everything. Tough concentration there from the uh, Indiana native Skylar Diggins Smith. You know, I wish we saw that replay it from a different angle because I was talking about her feet set and that follow through. It's automatic and so much so, even though when the defender's running at her and fouls her, she still hits that shot. Four point play, that's the first of the day, I think, isn't it? Mm, it sure is. Damovich, 12 point lead for the US. Catch and shoot there for Vasic, cleaned up by Awumake, looking to break. Fouls is ahead of her, that's not a choice for her. And Shin's a bit of trouble here, almost. Bird, Davovic is on the floor, Skyler Diggins, Smith down to Fowles. And Sylvia Fowles has made a living in her career of getting the ball two feet down and finishing. Davovic turns on the corner, oh, she gets an hand on herself. Stewart will get the foul. And Anna Davovic will go to the line, 14 the difference. This crowd just waiting. To waiting explode. a chance to get yeah. into this game, yeah. It's going to take, I think it's going to take a couple of big three-pointers. Malkovic knows full well the enormity of this task ahead of us to win this game. I think somebody stepped in, the whistle went, but the ball went in anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, a little press here oh, from Serbia. Oh, that was deflected Ooh. too, almost turned over. Davic almost ended that one, that one on a lap. Bird. Well, that has been turned over. Davids will get a layup here. And 
finishes in style. Maybe that's the spot they need. Sue Bird does not get turned over very often. Digging Smith, little run and jump. Stewart, Bird, no look past the rumor cake. That's what happens when you gamble defensively too much. Well, you know, they gambled the first time and it worked, and the second time it doesn't. So, 50 50 chance there, but good job for Serbia just to try and change it up against USA. Nice to Brooks. And we've got to make that. They've got the double team down low with Davovic against Bird. Now, Bird has lost Davovic once again. Jump shot, Sue Bird, front to the rim. Serbia are uh, hanging around here. Yeah, and Basic right there with the rebound, rim to rim. Ooh, Bird got a hand in. Now, oh my word, this ball is going around. Arumake tried to hit Bird. Bird said, this calm things down a bit. Yeah, Davovic is all over the place. She's playing excellent. Stewart back door, wide open, finish easy. That was uh, textbook flex play. Do you remember the flex offense? Of course I do. There you go. My oh. whole Olympic career. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah, we flexed oh, Tom, it to death. Tom Bayer likes that one. Yeah, yeah. right, yeah. Shadow hits, cut the first half. He's, he's gone ice cold in Alex since then. Danovic tries to... Danovic is gambling big time right now defensively, leaving a lot of holes in the defense. Fouls will finish this. Yeah, great job there from Strip down past. And I think the thing is sometimes I, I always am skeptical about, you know, Davovic running through the pass and they try and try and try and because then it puts your team out of position as Brooks. Oh, sure. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Nice little run from Brooks. Yeah, it's, a, it's an instant five on four because she's dived and, tried, and she's put herself out of the defensive play. But sometimes it works for her advantage. But I think coaches will tell you don't gamble, right? Don't put yourself in a position of disadvantage. There's another gamble right there, reaching for the ball, Diggins Smith. And I, think, I, I think with Diggins Smith, they yeah. smell a bit of blood, right? Yeah. Maybe they feel that she can't handle the ball as well. Yeah. Super. All sales subs in the great game. Chelsea Gray will take the PG position. Griner's going to come in and occupy the paint, and Aja Wilson's going to be the backup. Yeah, and Skylar Diggins Smith is asking the referee, excuse me, what about my eye? Davidich is coming in, they called a jump ball, but she's like, look at my eye, please, call something. But, uh, but I'm just going back to Davidich, that's her style, you know what I mean? She's a very risky player, she's running through passing lanes, and so sometimes if, if I'm playing with her, I know that's the type of player she is, so I've got to be ready to, you know, have her back and defend right after she tries to get the steal. Yep. Stewart. Three. That's the first shot for Brianna Stewart from downtown. She's got the game inside outside. She's the complete package. Yeah, nice little play for her. Little cut inside and easy three point shot. Here's the passage. Looks one way. Finds Butelija. Goes down low to uh, Brooks. And all of a sudden, Brooks' game is opening up. Here we a good go. pass there. Oh, yeah. Pick and pop. They post for Griner. And they went for the same backdoor cut from Stewart. Has Vazic got this foul? Yeah, Vazic, yes. Yeah, she uh, bumped uh, Stewart as she comes across yeah, here. Butelija, I think, gets it. And Stewart's first three. Quick release, high release. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's been uh, hours and hours of practice in the gym. Stewart again, head fake this time. Nice look. Diggins Smith, Stewart, and uh, Brianna Stewart is beginning to warm up. I don't think she scored the first half, did she? No, she didn't, but that's fine. I talked about it, just trying to get yourself back into the game, get in shape, and really just getting your touch back. It, that, that takes time. Uh, but like I said, I'm, I'm really pleased for her to keep pushing, keep shooting, keep driving. And that, ooh, Chelsea Gray behind the back to Brittany. Throw it down. No doubt. A nice smooth go for Brittany Grimes. I, I set it up that she's going to dunk what she did, but I need to speak to her after the game, mate. Get things right. We, all of a sudden, it didn't take long, but it's a 19-point lead for the States. Brooks down low, Stewart the foul. Brianna Stewart turns to the referee and says, well, what else can I do? 
So Stuart come out. There's the replay. I don't think she did much wrong. No. And also, uh, um, USA is doing a great job of Stuart's minutes, I think, as she is coming back. You just, you know, give her a good spurt and then sub her uh, for Atkins as she comes in. Krasinic down low. Ooh, a great look to Krasinic. Had two open layups the first period. There's another one she probably thinks she might want to get back and take again. Yeah. Atkins in. I think she's just afraid of, um, of Brittany Griner. Great minutes. You know, the first time we saw that of Aja Wilson high and Griner low, they reversed it this time. Right. So Aja Wilson doesn't necessarily have the height that Griner does, but uh, she has the power. Yeah, she has the power and the work ethic. She works very early on her post-up moves, and right there she gets rewarded with the high-low action of her and Brittany Griner. So timeout on the floor, and uh, Marina Malkovic will look up to the scoreboard and see a 21-point deficit. It's going to take a lot of work to get back in this game. shots here the emotion of this game I can imagine by Sunday late Saturday Sunday when we start deciding who's going to be going to Tokyo who's not this is going to get even more tense in this arena definitely and also it'll be um, who else uh, Nigeria and Mozambique are also in this group and uh, today Nigeria put on a wonderful performance an all-round epic performance by uh, Nigerian champions, uh, champions of the Afro basket. So I would love to see how they uh, match up and compare to USA and uh, a great team in Europe. Right, exactly right. Asia Wilson finishes the three-point play there. So uh, all uh, Skylar Diggins Smith is the only starter still in the game. Four subs for the USA, and they haven't really missed a beat. Have they? And one for Brooks. I'm not sure who's got the foul. Uh, Asia, I think, Asia Wilson. Yeah. I think she said, my bad. But she needs to know that scout because that is Brooke. She loves to put the ball on the floor, one pull, uh, one dribble pull up. That's that's in her repertoire, so Angel that's why she says, my bad. Good for you, Stu. Was that your nickname, Stu and Colin? No. Or Z? Yeah, Z was my name. Stu. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you ever say that again. Uh, no, duly noted. So free throw for Brooks to come here, try and get some inroads. It's a 20-point game after a great move. She's going to break it into 19. I think uh, Brianna Stewart is Stewie. That's, That's right. Nickname. Yes, you're right. Soft throw for Brooks as she subs in. Oh, for the obvious Brie as well, I think, isn't it? Uh, Stankovic, yes, Bree as well. Stankovic comes in for Brooks. Great minutes from her. And a little press here. No worries. I love the way Ariel Atkins came to the ball. That means that lob pass had to be, couldn't be double teamed from the weak side. Oh, it's been picked the pocket. Boy, it's almost got there. Kutali just right up on uh, Diggins Smith here. Good show from Stankovic. Skip pass to uh, Gray. Great. Long, long way out. Uh, Serbia do come up with it. Diana Bukalija. Miljana Bujevic. Bukalija. Skoric. They're running out of shot clock here. Quickly. Seven seconds. Bujevic, great pass. Stankovic layup. Blew it. It was there. Stankovic comes back in. I think Ryan has taken one for the head. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, I think. Sadly, Ugh. hopefully she's all right. Yeah, she went down. I think as uh, Stankovic went up for that layup, she just, her offhand maybe hit Brittany in the face. I'm pretty sure, look, here it is, boom. Well, Stankovic has just realized what uh, effect she's had on Ryder and gone up to uh, say, okay, dude. 
Yeah, there's been great sportsmanship from both teams earlier. Skyler Ding and Smith picking up uh, Dabovic in here. Uh, Stankovic, she knows that's an accident as she went up, she hits Brittany and she says sorry, so yep. lovely sportsmanship. Okay, uh, Lloyd in. Ooh, it was almost turned over. Jewel Lloyd gets it back and lay up from Gray. Uh, sorry, excuse me, Adkins. So a fortunate two there for the U.S. Foul there for Ariel Atkins. Playing her part both ends for the scorer's table. University of Texas, Ariel Atkins. In case you're asking, I know you weren't, from Duncanville, Texas. <laughs> it's good to know because I didn't know that. Thank you very much. So how many first-round draft picks on this team, the U.S.A.? That's another good question for you. On the whole roster or on the yep. floor right now? On, on, on the whole roster, yeah. On the okay, roster. I'm going to say... It's not a bad number. Mm. It's a good pass down low to Stankovic. Dragan and Stankovic goes up. Butalija tries to follow Brian and says, swap that out of here. Take your time. Minute 19 and the third to go. I'm going to say eight. Wow, that's not bad guess. Oh, 12. Six. Oh. Six. I said Sylvia Fowles, Smith. You're going to go through them, are you? Okay. Uh, Paul McCain, sorry. Uh, Julie Lloyd, Lloyd. Jump shot. Griner tries to keep it alive, as does uh, Wilson. Wilson powers it up. My word, some power there, isn't there? And the USA just dominating the boards right now. Back out to Gray. Gray waves it through. It is the low post matchup. Griner, skip pass. Julie Lloyd in and out. Good running from Draganis. Uh, Stankovic misses the J. Griner picks it away from uh, 24 Skoric. Beautiful pass. Wilson up. Oh, the foul will go against Butalija. Is Wilson one of the. Yes, Asia Wilson was a first round pick. Okay, thank you. I'm going to say Brittany Griner also was. Well, Griner definitely was, yeah. Awumake was one as well back in 2012. And um, was obviously uh, Brianna Stewart. Yep. And I've got Sue Bird. Is yeah, Sue Bird. And the other one is on the floor right now. Drew Lloyd. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, yeah. Lloyd, okay. I didn't do too bad. Eight no, out of six. very good. I had uh, Sylvia Fowles as one, too. Yeah, that, that, she was drafted by the eight. sky, wouldn't she? And um, I'm trying to think of why she didn't go first round. 2008, she was second pick. I wonder who would have been first pick then. Was that... Uh, uh, that be that's pa oh, Parker. What they from the same Yeah, yeah, yeah. Krasinic to Butalija. Oh, it's a, a great executed play there, Bojevic. It's 19.8 uh, the third. It's tough going right now for Serbia. Was uh, Katie Samuelson not top round pick? Uh, no, she I was the wasn't. fourth pick in 2000 this year, fourth pick by the uh, by the okay, sky. That's, that's not bad though. No, no, top, no, no. Top ten. Yeah. As Chelsea Gray runs out the clock, Brittany Griner is, is going to set her a screen. In fact, Chelsea Gray is the lowest pick. She was 11. She down to 14. Travel. That looked a good move from Wilson in the end. But you're right, the, the travel came in. You big some travel. I don't know what it no, is. Pick you it up your pivot for, for your dribble. You stop that right there. I'm going to tell you why after this. Yeah. You know why? Because it's different rules between American and overseas Europe, I think, for sure. As we see the score, there's 70 to America and 47 to Serbia. Going back to my point about you bigs uh, traveling. Wait, 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 wait. Backtrack. Different rules. Uh, first of all, let me do my, my stats before I get there. Two pointers uh, for USA. I'm shooting 61% and 41% from the three point line. Pretty good clip for them. Uh, Serbia's just letting USA get away from them um, here in the third. But obviously, overall, I think Serbia's doing a very good job. They're, they're showing, you know, they're gritting out. Here we see a Bubba game with a nice reverse move there. And then uh, Stewie will then oh, same again. Anyway, as I was saying, right? Yeah. Cool. So post plays. When I 
I grew up playing basketball in England, and then I went to America, did high school and, and uh, college. And you can take a step, then dribble, kind of thing. Does that make sense? Where? In, in America. So it, it's kind of like you can step dribble. In, in England, in, in Europe, you have to dribble step. So I would have said that the referees in America are more stringent on travel than they were in Europe. But it's different because even uh, with America, you can, ca uh, you can catch one, two, shoot, right? I'm right. talking in the river, if, yep. if this makes sense. Yep. So say I'm on the three-point line, you pass me the ball, I would never be on the three-point line, just to let you know that. But I'm on the three-point line, I'm living my best dreams through commentary here. I'm on the three-point line, you pass me the ball, I catch it, and yep. then I can go one, two. What, then no, no, shoot. Oh, I'm saying, talking about yeah, this is the saying, James yeah. Harden yeah. era of yeah, okay. you yeah, can do whatever you want yeah, these yeah. days. Okay, this is not the NBA, they definitely call that, but it's a different rhythm now to when I kind of grew up where you had yeah. to uh, dribble in in the same rhythm as yeah, your steps. Sure. Yeah, no, no, I got you. Yeah, yeah. Fourth period is set to start as we uh, digress on the rules of traveling and basketball. We'll stay away from that one, I think. Yeah, sorry. I if you don't know basketball, I think that's kind of hard to explain. Sure, it's in. And uh, we've got a foul against Jewel Lloyd, I think. Uh, so you'll say she came up with all ball. The referees will disagree. Two shots to come here for Shoreditch. I'm really impressed with Jewel Lloyd. She's definitely come along uh, in her career and now making it on the USA team. She has done really well. Uh, she plays with the um, Seattle Storm. And she is a real big force. One two punch with uh, Stewart before she got injured, and Sue Bird. She kind of came up under Sue Bird. Uh, and, yep. you know, and that's why I think has really improved her game, learning from the best. Nice look over the top there for Ariel Atkins. He's looked for somebody under the hoop. Reiner wasn't really ready for it. And Chelsea Gray will start this thing and, and you know when the United States get into a half court pattern they look very very good when they're on the break they look even better of course this has been oh that's unfortunate for Serbia I thought they did really well there three is Milkovic Maya Milkovic in the game for the first time getting a bit of uh, PT not quite there quick enough but she puts her hand up says that's my foul here we have Joel Lloyd with the ball. Oh, and a foul. The referees are whistle happy right now, aren't they? 15. Is that Boyevich? Come on, refs. <laughs> trying to go home here. <laughs> <laughs> and now they call the whistle again. She must well, be at least. She was over the plane. the plane. They call it the plane, don't they? The line is a plane. Boyevich stepped over. Right. I wonder if that's a warning for a technical foul next time. I think that's what they're saying. They walked all the way down to the Malkovich to explain the call. That means there must be a warning involved as well. Wide open is Jewel Lloyd here. Great pass. Aja Wilson, the beneficiary of some uh, beautiful uh, vision on the floor from Jewel Lloyd. Yeah, fantastic play there by Jewel Lloyd right on time after I complimented her. Yeah, you got it. She's showing off. Shurich, get the roll in. Krasinic goes up against Greiner. And another whistle. Greiner turns around and said, where was that foul? I think the referee's been good all day, so we're probably going to see a foul in here somewhere. No, no, right there. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know whether that offhand is a foul, though, because part of the offense... No, right at the top of her shot. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah. I must admit, though, today has been a great day of basketball. This is our fourth game of the day. We've been here since 9 a.m. Uh, and I've really had a good time. And to finish off with the host team and the number one in the world. You know, you know how happy that makes me? You've had a good time. Because if you're happy, I think we're every, we're, everybody's happy for you. We're all having a good time. You know, have you heard the saying, happy co-host, happy yeah, life? Yeah, they have. Again, the states go over the top to break the press. This is oh, beautiful Nolan Park. Dry now, what a finish. Oh, my word. Let me see that again, please. Jewel Lloyd was looking over to the scorer's table, all of a sudden throws this puck. There you go. Have a piece of that, Brittany. Top play, I Love think. Love it. Love that top no-look play for uh, Jewel Lloyd there. She is definitely showing off. You know you, how we have the... Uh, you you the don't appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> we do, we love that. 
As long as you get the ball, you'll love it, yeah. Um, but you know, we talk about the uh, commentator's curse yes. right now. We're talking about the commentator's, uh, let's say, the dazzle. Because Lloyd is definitely coming up to shine after oh. we complimented her. Sure, Lloyd, I get it, yeah. Nice little look up there, Stankovic. Hawks a little 15 foot up. And you know, great rebound for Krasnitz, my word. She was taking no prisoners under the hoop right there. Yeah, good that job. My ball and my ball written all over it. She had to work hard for that against Brittany as well. And look at the defense. They pulled the turnover. AJ Wilson's poor pass to Brittany Griner. This Serbian team can only get better. Definitely. By playing teams like this. Krasnitz jump shot. This is another body on Joel Lloyd on the floor again, knocked down by Stankovic this time. He's Lloyd. And uh, great distributor is Joel Lloyd. Screen Keeps that ball moving. Yeah. Chelsea Gray in. Beautiful Woo! pass to Wilson. And uh, Sue Bird was the first off the bench to get up and congratulate that play. Fantastic by uh, Chelsea Gray. I told you about that. She has some really nice dimes. But also, Serbia's kind of emptied out their bench. They've put their starters on. They know this is going to be... Uh, USA is not the game that they truly need the win. Uh, they've got Mozambique and Nigeria later on in the tournament. So they've emptied out their bench here as we see the foul. Chelsea Gray, I think it is 18, I think they called it. Yeah. A lot of pumping going on there. Huh? Great pass there from Lawyer, from Gray down the other end. Aja Wilson, easy two. Who picks get some easy points, I tell you. Oh, here you go. Again. Laid on a plate for her. <laughs> Backdoor play for Krasnic, keeps it in play beautifully. I think, no, maybe just touch the line. Oh, are you going to give us big a break? <laughs> if it wasn't for us. That was, that was unfortunate for Krasnic. They had just a little hop as she uh, went to get a balance. But the one-handed grab, you know, the, uh, the skill level I've seen today. Brittany Griner, outstanding hands. Krasnic, outstanding hands. Wilson. Yeah, Adrian Wilson, another one. Hey, you're naming all the bigs right now, Vic. Well, the guards have, by, by definition, I'm sorry. They've got great hands. Oh, oh, what a pass. Oh, Adrian Wilson's got the biggest smile of the day on her face because she knew she was wide open and uh, digging Smith on the bench there. What a pass from Chelsea Gray. It, it was nowhere near. Samuelson comes into the game, but the fact that it was open and Major Wilson knows it was open. Yeah, that was pretty cool that happened. Krasinich looks at the three. Thought better of it. Great defense from Jewel Lloyd. You know, this has been a great physical game and Serbia has definitely stepped up to uh, USA's physicality. For sure, Chad a long, long three. Short, she got hot in the first quarter. It's uh, not been the same result since. Wilson. Gray. Gray into the lane, little drag back, fade away. Chelsea Gray. Oh, good rebound in there from... Uh, Atkins. Like Atkins. Mm. She's a, a workhorse. She is definitely working hard, uh, get, giving USA extra possessions, enjoying her play. I haven't seen much of her, but I, I really like what she brings to this team. Yeah, and I think she was a late addition one. I can't remember who dropped out now. Uh, Tarassi. Tarassi was it, and Atkins mm -hmm. came in for her, yeah. Mm -hmm. Wilson will bully her way in for this one. Offensive rebound. Is uh, Chado instead of Tabojevic. 6:30 left in this game. There's still a lot to be uh, gained for Serbia in this game, even though they trail by 25. Shorich, sure, they've controlled tempo very, very well, and to do that, you've got to take care of the Chado. Lines up a long shot. She'll get her own rebound. Great pass to Stankovic. Nice finish. Um, there's a lot. They take care of the ball. Therefore, if you don't make turnovers, you don't necessarily give up easy points down the other end on fast breaks. So yeah. The States have had to get into a half-court game a lot here. Right, and I think they've done a great job of keeping uh, USA as uh, Stankovic steals the ball there from Wilson. And the defense has been great right. for Serbia. They've done a great job uh, holding USA to one shot and smothering them uh, to make them only shoot one shot and then getting the rebound. That's yeah. really been the uh, great thing that they can take up for the next part of the tournament. Boyovic, great kick, Shorich wide, wide open, three points for Shorich, Maya Shorich. Oh, what a pass from Boyovic, she'll take that assist every day of the, of the week. 
20-point game now. Sanderson goes in for her first look at the uh, hoop. Probably an ill-advised shot, I would think. Shoreage, she might repay the, the compliment to Chado. Oh, she missed it. That was one that needed to go down for Sasha Chado. Great, doing her magic. Sanderson fancies her chances from the three-point line. Stankovic has been fouled. I think this is Jewel Lloyd's foul. I think jumping over the back of Stankovic. I, I am um, wrong. Is that Aja Wilson's foul? That was, I think. As she bumps out there, you see. She kind of hooks it there. She gets away with one. Oh, I see. Yeah. Um, I have a trivia question for you. Whoa, Which player has a sister? Oh, come on. What? Let me explain. Some people might not know. Has a sister in this tournament, but not on the same team. Oh, you insult me. You're not asking me that question, right? That's to, that's to everybody else. Can you please write your answers on a postcard? <laughs> oh, that's the old thing. Email it in. Oh, gosh. Okay, yeah. well, I'm just Go giving on. them the fun fact. Go on, yeah, Come on you answer it. No, no, I can't. no, it's all yours. So it's Katie, uh, number 33, Samuelson for USA, as we get a nice driving kick here. Charlie's got a hit in a minute. There he is. Yeah, uh, number 33, great hit from Serbia on USA. And then her sister, as we see the highlight there, uh, uh, Carly plays for Great Britain. Yes. So pretty cool. They both are here in Serbia. And I got to speak to them before the game as Atkins takes a shot, misses wildly. Wow. This is finishing with Serbia on a bit of a roll here. It's a 17-point game. Three points here will make it interesting. Shorts goes in, is fouled by Samuelson. Oh, you can guarantee they're going to count this one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what a... Look at this, just gets her... Yeah, she just puts her hand in there right at the last minute. A timeout for USA, I think it's their timeout. Dan Reeves, Cheryl Reeves and Dan Hughes will uh, get themselves together, just calm things down a bit here. Yeah, you don't want to get the crowd in it either, so just take no. the timeout and um, calm the nerves. But you know, it's... Uh, USA aren't used to this, right? No. Time out the fourth period. How many games did they actually call it because they don't need to? But uh, there's definitely signs that just need to settle things down a bit. Yeah, and Sue Bird is the first one into that timeout uh, to just say, settle things down, ladies. We're fine here. Uh, as they just turn she's over. She's a national team coach, maybe, for her experience. Yeah, let's see what she says. For Mick here, um, my Spanish, my Portuguese, my Chinese. You get on the American. Right? <laughs> so interesting enough, Cheryl Reeve there, um, Minnesota, Minnesota Lynx in the WNBA, three WNBA champions. Dan Hughes has his own WABM championship because he got the job at the Seattle Storm and won it first time up. Didn't he? Wow, amazing. Yeah. And um, yeah, she's won three championships with the Lynx. Yes, yeah. is that right? Yeah. Okay. And uh, Temi Peck Bentley for Great Britain uh, has played under her with that championship, and also Sylvia Fowles is one of her players, also, as she misses that shot. Well, Brian is back in the game because the States uh, just sent a little bit of uh, finish this game off, or a need to finish it off. Tiffany Mitchell in the game for the first time, uh, Zenia. Reiner is short, and all of a sudden, Nice. Serbia have a bit between their teeth. They're 15 down, so maybe a little a bit much too late, possibly. Great shot. That's going to go in to uh, Sonja Vasic. Sorry, excuse me. Maya Milkovic there. Yeah, good little energy here from Serbia. This is the bench, too. Yeah. This is one of the starters. This causing this, uh, I wouldn't say panic, but it's like, take notice. Deflection there. A winner came. It's great. Ray has to fire up a long three. Oh, Chado gets called for the foul. This Was is there any need to get that close with I the shot clock running down? Yeah, I don't even think she gets that close. I just don't think she lets Chelsea Gray land. 
and you're not allowed to do that. Look, as she takes a shot, look, she's yeah, right under the feet. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's close enough for me. Yeah, you're not. As she has that black eye there, she's uh, sporting that one very well. But you have to let an offensive player, as uh, she gets the soft foul, you have to let the offensive player have space to land after she's taken the shot, and that's where that foul came from. You're spot on, Rosie. You're almost getting through your level three referees <laughs> badge just in one game here. Thank you. Well, uh, when I was um, commentating in the Afro basket, I got the pleasure to ride with the re referees back and forth to the gym, so... I'm not going to comment on that. No, no, I just got to ask them lots of questions. That would be, that would be my worst nightmare. I really? Think. Oh, yeah. There's just so much of the game that I still don't know, even as a player. It's an argument I can never win. That's why I hate it. Foul's been called. It's on uh, the newcomer, Tiffany Mitchell. Yeah, there's so much. They do go for a lot of training, a lot of rules. There's some stuff that I still don't understand. So it was quite interesting to ride the bus to and from yeah. uh, from the Senegal arena. Two shots here for Maya Milkovic. Yes. Just made a layup in the lane. Yeah, she's had some really good minutes for them. And this is what's good about emptying your bench. You really show coach what you're made of, you know, build your trust, show that you're a trustworthy to play, that you're not going to make mistakes, and you can score. I can guarantee you now, Marina Malkovic will allude to this fourth period play by the bench team in the uh, press conference because they've been outstanding this last five minutes. Chelsea Gray, pressure from Bojevic. Gray gets it back on the far side. Bojevic right there, hand up in her face. Reiner with the ball screen. Gray penetrates through the leg, loses Bojevic. Atkins doesn't know what to do with it. Corner Mitchell missed it. Now, who's touched that last? We're going to say it's USA's Griner, I think, that's tipped it last. The crowd can sense something special here. And, uh, yeah, Chelsea Gray right there. You see her touch it right out of bounds. Great defensive possession there for Serbia. Make them take a tough out of the paint shot. And Brittany Griner didn't touch the ball pretty much that whole possession. So great job for Serbia. Good defense. Let's get a good offense here. Milkovic goes in. Milkovic goes up. Oh, that's a tough one to miss. It was there. That'll be a foul against Dragana Stankovic just over the back of Griner. Be two shots down the other end for the uh, six foot seven American. That could have been a little nudge there from Mitchell, couldn't it, on that layup? And Stankovic. She's upset. Oh, well, sure. But it's easy points down the other end. In a 14 point game that could easily be 12. Fine margins, Isenia, fine yep. margins. Yep. And uh, Brittany Griner sinks that first free throw. That's great. Let's see if she's got a second one in her. Oops. Yeah. It's a good atmosphere in here. They're kind of playing their part for this home team, that's for sure. Here's the offense they tried to scout the USA at the moving screen there from Stankovic. That's just another foul. And again, I'll go back to Bojevic. Bojevic didn't wait for the screen. Therefore, Stankovic is still moving across the lane as she's trying to use the screen. Here's the replay here. There, it's Ariel Atkins that gets run into uh, the, the wall of Stankovic. Yeah. I love the pressure from uh, Serbia too. Tiffany Mitchell brings up, guarded by Mitchell. Milkovic. Yeah, that was almost deflected the pass to Awumake. That one was for Bojevic. Reiner down low, triple team. And a foul. Yes. Well, you've got the defense. One reach. Chad will get this foul. Yes. Serbia's asking for the travel, but she had four players hanging off of her there. Great job by Brittany Griner to just hold that ball up high and uh, Ultimately, she has now, yeah, they're in uh, foul trouble, so she goes to the line. Now you know why Sasha Chado has a black eye. She's going to go in there <laughs> right. and get down low and take that ball off Griner. Yeah. No fear. Yeah, I've had a few black eyes in my day. It's uh, part and parcel of playing in the paint, isn't it? Yeah, I think so, for sure. Griner, this time, goes two for two. USA closing this game out fairly comfortably, 17 to 
the difference. Just under two to play now. Yeah, if I'm Serbia, I'm pretty happy with this performance. Um, you know, you've come and you've played all your 12 players, and Stankovic takes the shot there. It's a beautiful pass, and Milkovic couldn't drop it. Stankovic, you'll know that one was not begging. I think they've stayed true to themselves, Serbia. They've played tough minutes. Oh, I've been really impressed. Wide, wide, wide open is uh, a Wumike, I think. It is in the stand, the referee in the way. I can't see another Wumike. Back to Gray. Yeah, great rebound by Chelsea Gray to oh, give them a second. Pass, far corner, Atkins three. They haven't made many shots the second half of the United States, have no, they? No, they haven't. Definitely clean up on that, but that's all right. They're getting second chances, especially... Boyevich. Stankovic goes chasing in, but the woman K wins that battle. Especially with uh, Atkins in the game, she has given them a wonderful second chance, and she's crashing in there, no doubt, so... She's uh, played a lot of minutes, hasn't she? She has, she has. Ryan wanted it over the top. Out to Tiffany Mitchell. Mitchell will go in, and uh, easy two for Tiffany Mitchell. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy for Atkins, because especially if she was the last on this roster and now is playing big minutes, uh, she filled um, Diana Tarasi, and you see the shot go up there. Chalo! It's her fourth three of the game. That play is designed for her. Definitely. Comes off that double flare screen. Yep, that is drawn up for her, perfectly executed by Serbia there. Um, I was just saying about Atkins, I was, I was impressed with her minutes today. Yes, absolutely. She's on the ball, starting to play. Mitchell, Aruma K. Reiner goes up, great kick out. Long three, Chelsea Gray. I'm not sure how many threes they've hit the second uh, half, but uh, there haven't been many. And Bojevic now will play for the last shot. Oh, great pass, Milkovic for three, and that will be that. The United States will take this victory, 88-69. And as in one, this crowd has risen to their feet to salute their hometown heroes. It's been a... I, I really have thoroughly enjoyed this. 19 points has never crashed the game you... Uh, enjoy. You can enjoy, but yeah. my word, Serbia's fourth quarter performance. Going right. back to 14, could have been 12. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and, they, uh, and that's that fourth quarter was all with their bench players. Their starters sat yes. and they were getting ready for the next game. So the yeah. fact that they played so well with their second unit, oh, yeah. pretty good. And it shows that uh, this team has much to offer. You know, they've got uh, two games left, Mozambique and Nigeria, to make the Olympics. They, uh, they're favorites to win both games. But even winning the one, they beat Mozambique for sure there at their group. Mm -hmm. Um, and between now and the Olympics, this team can only get better. You know how hard the Serbian teams work. Yeah, I would totally agree with you. And also, what's so, you know, exciting about this team is, as we go along in these tournaments, is about depth, okay? Yeah, your starting five is great, but who is your sixth, seventh, eighth man? And this last fourth quarter for Serbia, to put in that, you know, Stankovic, all those, that whole crew, and for them to play very well and hold uh, USA, so quite a good set. And
22, isn't she? 22, 23? Yeah, she's the new up-and-coming new age basketball for sure. And now joining this team the last couple of years. She, she's a new Sylvia Fowles, in my opinion. Uh, great post player, had all-round game. Ne next gen, isn't it? The West next Cook. gen. Go on, go. Then. You're the cool one in this team. <laughs> that is uh, open to discussion for sure. <laughs> I'm not even sure that is a discussion. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed everything. I've uh, really been impressed with this uh, Serbian team. As always, we're always impressed with the USA team. They never fail to uh, put on a good show. They're intense, they're prepared, and the, uh, their ability to work harder and work everybody else is uh, just something to, to sit back and savor. We'll have four more games tomorrow. No, nope. oh, we have wrong. a day up Saturday. Tomorrow. Make sure you don't get up tomorrow and watch the game. It'll be Saturday, starting at lunchtime. Four games, 12, 2.30 GMT, then 5, uh, 5.30 and 8 o'clock, I think it is. Enjoy these last few moments of these replays, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye for now. Good night.